this the fair lady Cresset? Even she. Welcome, sweet lady, to the Greeks. <laughs> Our general does salute you with a kiss. Yet is the kindest but particular. T'were better she were kissed in general. I'll take that winter from your lips, fair lady. Achilles bids you welcome. I had good argument for kissing once. But that's no argument for kissing now. <laughs> for thus talked Paris in his hardiment, and parted thus you and your argument. The first was Menelaus' kiss. This, mine. Patroclus kisses you. No, this is trim. <laughs> Paris and I kiss evermore for him. I'll have my kiss, sir, lady, by your leave. In kissing, do you render or receive? Both take and give. I'll make my match to live. The kiss you take is better than you give. Therefore, no kiss. <laughs> I'll give you boots. I'll give you three for one. You are an odd man. Give even or give none. An odd man? Why, every man is odd. No, Paris is not. For you know tis true that you are odd, and he is even with you. <laughs> you fill me up head. No, I'll be sore. It were no match your nail against his horn. <laughs> may I, sweet lady, beg a kiss of you? You may. I do desire it. Why beg, then? Oh, why then, for Venus' sake, give me a kiss when Helen is made again and his. I am your debtor. Claim it when tis due. Never is my day. And then a kiss of you. Lady, a word. I'll bring you to your father. 